From the timeless masterpiece Gladiator and its highly anticipated sequel, to the potential involvement of Pedro Pascal and the continuation of the gladiatorial saga, this is Pedro Pascal's Gladiator 2 mystery role revealed. When the Gladiator burst onto the big screen back in 2000, it generated an incredible amount of hype and anticipation. People were buzzing with excitement to witness this grand epic unfold. Directed by Ridley Scott, Gladiator boasted a stellar cast led by Russell Crowe in the role of Maximus, a fierce Roman general turned gladiator. The film combined intense action sequences, breathtaking visuals, and a gripping storyline set against the backdrop of ancient Rome. The marketing campaign surrounding Gladiator was carefully crafted to build anticipation. Trailers showcased the film's epic battles, sweeping landscapes, and powerful performances, enticing audiences with a taste of the grandeur to come. The buzz around the film grew exponentially, with fans eagerly discussing the movie's potential and eagerly awaiting its release. When Gladiator finally hit theaters, it exceeded expectations. Audiences were enthralled by the gripping narrative, the adrenaline-pumping gladiatorial combat, and the emotional depth of the characters. The film struck a chord with viewers, resonating on both an action-packed spectacle level and a profound human level. Gladiator's success wasn't just limited to the box office. It garnered critical acclaim as well, earning rave reviews for its stunning cinematography, intricate production design, and powerful performances. Russell Crowe's portrayal of Maximus was widely praised, and the film's score, composed by Hans Zimmer, added to its grandeur. The hype surrounding Gladiator was fueled by its triumphant journey through award season. The film went on to win five Academy Awards, including Best Picture and Best Actor for Russell Crowe. The recognition solidified Gladiator as a true cinematic masterpiece and cemented its place in film history. To this day, Gladiator is remembered as a classic that captured the hearts and imaginations of audiences. Its legacy continues to inspire and influence filmmakers, reminding us of the power of a compelling story, captivating performances, and the sheer thrill of experiencing an epic tale on the big screen. So, with the announcement of Gladiator 2, will director Ridley Scott be able to recreate his previous success? Pre-production of Gladiator 2 has begun with no available trailer or footage yet. Fans eagerly await Ridley Scott's mysterious continuation. Considering the immense success of the first film, a theatrical release for Gladiator 2 is highly likely. But a streaming release on Paramount Plus is not ruled out. Gladiator 2 is set to hit theaters on November 22, 2024, taking audiences on another captivating journey to ancient Rome. While explicit plot details are yet to be revealed, Paul Meskel's casting as an all-grown-up Lucius, the nephew of Commodus, provides some clues. Lucius, inspired by Maximus, has become a gladiator, and his story will continue, returning as the director is Ridley Scott, known for his remarkable filmography that includes Alien, Blade Runner, and The Martian. Joining him is screenwriter David Scarpa, who previously collaborated on All the Money in the World, the crew also features familiar faces from the original Gladiator, such as production designer Arthur Max and costume designer Janty Yates. Paul Meskel takes on the lead of Lucius, while Barry Keon and Denzel Washington are also part of the cast. Other cast members, including potential returning actors like Connie Nielsen and Jaiman Hansu, remain undisclosed, intriguing fans about the full ensemble. As Gladiator 2 gears up for production, fans eagerly anticipate this next chapter in the gladiatorial saga, eagerly awaiting its release to witness the grandeur and excitement that made the original film a classic. Pedro Pascal, star of HBO's The Last of Us, is in final negotiations to join the untitled Gladiator sequel for Paramount. Pascal's role is currently unknown. The original Gladiator film won five Oscars, including Best Picture, and starred Russell Crowe as Maximus. The sequel will feature Paul Meskel as Lucius and include actors such as Barry Keon, Joseph Quinn, Connie Nielsen, and Denzel Washington. Pascal's involvement in the Gladiator sequel comes during the hiatus of The Last of Us Season 2. He has gained popularity through his roles in Game of Thrones, The Mandalorian, and various film projects. Plot details for Gladiator 2 are tightly guarded, but there are speculations based on ancient Roman history. One theory suggests that Pascal's character will seek revenge against the Emperor, played by Paul Meskel, after the murder of Lucius. Another theory proposes Pascal could be the titular gladiator, drawing inspiration from a soldier who assassinated Caracalla, the Emperor. Ridley Scott may create a new character for Pascal, as he did with the original gladiator, 
The sequel is expected to explore themes of power and revenge while introducing lesser-known historical figures. The film's release is highly anticipated, and audiences are excited to see Pedro Pascal's continued success and dominance in the entertainment industry. Pedro Pascal has been making waves in the entertainment industry, appearing in numerous projects and captivating audiences. From his role in The Mandalorian to hosting Saturday Night Live, Pascal has been everywhere. With the simultaneous release of The Last of Us and the third season of The Mandalorian, there is an abundance of Pedro Pascal content available. Each day brings new information about Pascal's upcoming ventures. Following his appearance on Hot Ones with Sean Evans, it is expected that he will present at the Academy Awards and star in the season finale of The Last of Us, showcasing his versatility. Pascal continues to release commercials, episodes, and interviews, providing his fans with an array of enjoyable content. Witnessing his busy schedule is a rewarding experience, especially for longtime supporters who have followed his journey in the industry. It is truly a joy to see Pedro Pascal shine in various projects. Prior to his notable roles in The Mandalorian and The Last of Us, Pedro Pascal had already left his mark on the small and big screens. Fans recognized him for his portrayal of Oberyn Martell in Game of Thrones, where he sought revenge for his sister's death. However, Pascal's acting career predates his breakthrough role. He had appeared in shows like NYPD Blue and portrayed Eddie on Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Additionally, he made a significant impact on the theater scene in New York. Despite his early presence in the industry, Pascal's rise to stardom has been gradual. Ober and Martell undeniably catapulted him into the spotlight, forever cementing his place in fans' hearts. Nevertheless, he continued to build his career steadily. Before becoming Din Djarin in The Mandalorian, Pascal delivered a remarkable performance as Javier Pena in the Netflix series Narcos, and delved into the realm of science fiction with the film Prospect. He also had the opportunity to collaborate with his close friend Oscar Isaac on Triple Frontier. Pedro Pascal's recent surge in popularity marks an exciting new chapter in his journey. Pedro Pascal's presence is not limited to his appearances in upcoming shows. He has been cast in an upcoming movie by Pedro Almodovar, sharing the screen with Ethan Hawke. This new addition further enriches his already busy schedule, which includes The Last of Us and The Mandalorian. Remarkably, Pascal even found time to participate in an advertisement for a widely known mobile game. The game, Merge Mansion, features ads that have gained significant visibility. Pascal's involvement in the ad campaign adds an extra layer of intrigue. He shared the ad on his Instagram, provoking nostalgia among fans for his character Javier Pena in Narcos. Despite his packed agenda, Pascal's dedication to solving the mystery of the murderous grandma in the game is truly remarkable. As fans, we are thrilled to witness his busy schedule and share our admiration for his work with new followers who are just discovering his talents. Pedro Pascal's versatility and talent make this an exciting time to be his fan. From the immersive portrayal of ancient Rome to the enthralling narratives that captivate audiences, Gladiator and its sequel have solidified their places in film history. The journey through the gladiatorial saga continues, leaving fans eagerly awaiting the release of Gladiator 2 to witness the grandeur and excitement that made the original film a classic. With Pedro Pascal's rising prominence and remarkable talent, his potential role in Gladiator 2 adds another layer of anticipation and intrigue. As we look forward to the future chapters of this remarkable cinematic universe, it is undeniable that Gladiator and Gladiator 2 have left an indelible mark on the silver screen, forever etching themselves into the annals of filmmaking excellence. From the timeless masterpiece Gladiator and its highly anticipated sequel, to the potential involvement of Pedro Pascal in the continuation of the gladiatorial saga, this was Pedro Pascal's Gladiator 2 mystery role revealed.